Hello, today I stand here in our little chapel at St. John the Evangelist Anglican Church uh, in front of our window depicting St. Luke the physician nursing, uh, helping St. Paul who was in prison. Um, today I'd like to call to mind all the strain and stress that this COVID pandemic has caused um, so many of our healthcare workers. Um, and I want to do that by especially commemorating a, a different healthcare worker who is famous, and that is Florence Nightingale. This is about the time when we commemorate her in the church year. So here's a few words about Florence Nightingale. We remember Florence Nightingale chiefly for her work during the Crimean War, which took place between 1854 and 1856. Hearing the voice of God and animated by the spirit of service, she organized the first modern nursing service in the British field hospitals at Scutari and Balaclava. In the midst of appalling conditions, she was tireless in her efforts to relieve the sufferings of wounded and dying soldiers. Her solitary vigils in the hospital wards led the popular press to call her the Lady of the Lamp or the Angel of Scutari. Within four years of her return from the Crimea, Nightingale's health broke down and she eventually became a housebound invalid. But she continued to influence public policy and her labors helped to disperse the age-old prejudice against nurses, giving their profession high respectability. Her example also helped to liberate middle-class women from their subordinate and passive role in society. By the time of her death, at the age of 90, her reputation had assumed mythical proportions and to this day, she is still honored as the founder of the modern profession of nursing. So today, let us call to mind and pray for all our healthcare workers as they continue to heal and help those who are suffering from our pandemic, which is not over yet, unfortunately. So let us pray. Living God, you alone have power over life and death, over health and sickness. Give power, wisdom, and gentleness to those who follow the lead of Florence Nightingale, that they, bearing with them your presence, may not only heal but bless and shine as lanterns of hope in the darkest hours of pain and fear. Through Jesus Christ, the healer of body and soul, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen.